Today we are going to be doing a takeout review of Issa Chicago Pizza, a Chicago-inspired pizza chain that boasts an authentic Chicago-style pizza and the slogan, Pizza Done Right. Located at 9405 Cincinnati Columbus Road in Westchester, this location of East of Chicago Pizza is takeout or delivery only. The area of Westchester where they are located isn't as heavily populated as other far busier areas of the city. It's kind of off the beaten path a bit. It's an unassuming location that I'm sure I've driven past many times and I just haven't noticed it. Overall, not the best or worst location for a takeout pizza place. Seeing that this location doesn't have a dining in option, it's kind of pointless to try to rate its atmosphere. There's a front counter and a bench to sit on if you need to wait for your food. There's a cooler filled with bottled beverages for purchase. The walls are filled with pictures of groups that have visited, messages from customers, and some write-ups and accolades they've received. About what you'd expect from a takeout place. Their menu contains all the great stuff you'd expect from a pizza place. Pizza options from specialty to build your own. It's of note too that they have six different options of crust to choose from, including pan, thin, crispy, and the one I came for, the authentic Chicago style. Also available are subs, wings, and salads, and a bunch of bread-related sides like breadsticks, garlic cheese bread, and pizza bread. They also offer what they call foldovers, which is basically their version of a calzone. A lot of tasty looking options with a good variety of items to choose from. I sought out East of Chicago Pizza because I was interested and excited to try out their authentic Chicago style deep dish pizza. I've been on a continuing search to find an authentic Chicago style for a while now in the Cincinnati area. Some have come close, some not so much, but none have nailed it. I'm really sad to report that East of Chicago's Chicago style, in my opinion, didn't even come close. I really wanted to enjoy this pizza and some aspects of it I actually did, but overall I was let down because it wasn't the pizza I was looking for. I ordered a medium, uh, they only come in medium in that style, with pepperoni and bacon. It came out pretty quickly, which was nice and all, but in my mind it was the first indicator that it wasn't going to be the Chicago style I was hoping for, seeing that traditional Chicago style deep dish pizzas take a decent amount of time to cook. The pizza smelled delicious and looked great and legit as well. When I took my first bite, I realized it wasn't the authentic taste I had hoped for. The best way to describe the pizza would be if you were to make a normal style pizza, but just shape it and top it like a Chicago style, with cheese and toppings on the bottom and sauce on top. The crust didn't have that flaky and cornmeal-y taste and texture I was looking for. It just tasted like a normal pizza crust. That being said, the crust did have a nice taste to it, very garlicky with some other spices mixed in. While the sauce had a nice homestyle taste to it as well, it also was plentiful and it overpowered just about every other taste on the pizza. I could barely taste the cheese and could not taste the pepperoni bacon at all. I wouldn't say it's a bad pizza overall, just not what I was looking or hoping for. The service here was great. The employee who took my order was nice and pleasant. The food came out quickly. Again, maybe a little too quickly, but that's how the chain makes it. It's not the fault of the great service they provide here. With their pizzas ranging in price from $10 to $20 and subs and wings at reasonable prices, it seems like everything overall is at a pretty decent value. The price for the Chicago style would have been completely reasonable for an authentic Chicago style deep dish pizza, but was a little pricey for just a regular pizza made in the style of a Chicago deep dish. With an unassuming and seemingly easily overlookable location, what you'd expect the atmosphere to be at a strictly takeout and delivery location, a menu with a lot of variety and options, all right pizza despite an unfortunate failed attempt at an authentic Chicago style deep dish, great service, and at reasonable prices despite being a little pricey for their version of the Chicago style deep dish. East of Chicago Pizza gets a 3.8 out of 5, meaning despite its flaws, I still feel it's worth a shot. With plenty of other tasty options and still a decent tasting sauce and crust for their pizzas, I would absolutely give this place another shot down the road. But if you're looking for an authentic Chicago style deep dish pizza in the Cincinnati area, I'm sad to report that you're going to have to keep looking past East of Chicago Pizza.